Well, hello and welcome back, and thank you for coming back. Today, we are in downtown Cato Paphos, and we're in a Mercedes. LaBeouf is gonna drive us. LaBeouf, what have you got to say? How was that banana? It was good. Now, following on from a video I made earlier, if you remember, there was some bananas growing in the engine bay of a Nissan Micra, or a Nissan March, we call them. And Mr. Hassan, Mr. Grumpy, he's not grumpy actually, has presented to me in a empty filler can, that's what that is, a can of filler. He has presented to me some bananas. So that really, really shows you what he thinks of me, not a lot. Uh, Labouf, what hello have you got to say? Hello everybody, hello, hello, hello. Sorry, I couldn't say hello because my mouth was uh, okay. <coughs> busy. It was busy. I would like to tell to you that we are taking you now to the room tour on the roads of the local activities. Yes. So we're going to come out across to the hotel called, well it's a gumbara of mine actually, Alexander the Great. So, Mrs Carter, Mr Carter, Ellie Carter, if you're watching, in a few seconds you're going to see the hotel of your dreams and soon that you will be back there. So, get to the end of the booth and go left and then we'll do a little swing round and show them the exterior of that hotel, because we don't like that. So go left. There it is, look at that over there. Look at that. Alexander the Great, my Gumbaru. And we'll just slow down as we go past it and we'll see how Alexander is doing and his horse Stavros. <laughs> Stavros. It's a very popular name. In? There they are. Stavros there is, is a very popular name. Be careful when you call the horse. Stavros. There's Alexander our Gumbaru. And He's there's his angry. horse. Today he is very Stavros. angry. His yes. uh, thing, how you call this? His... I think it was a sword, is it? We'll have to climb up one day and have a look. He's going very angry, be very careful, angry. Mr. Paul. Right. You so, can't. we're going to drive that away along Posidonius Avenue in so the don't... wrong way from the harbour, go to the triangle and come round it, and then go that way to the harbour. And we're going to take you with us. And then we're going to go and hunt down Mr. and Mrs. Smoker. Have a drink, she can have a good smoke, and I'm very hungry. That a horse. Ah, by the way, I'm so hungry. Can I eat the? Can eat Stavros, yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know if Alexandra would be very happy, but we can try eating Stavros. Who's gonna cook it for? Who's gonna cook it? So, go a bit further. There's the Felix Bar, which featured in a video. There's the Rimini Restaurant, which is not in Italy, and there's the Golden Cafe, which is opening soon because the boss told us. Take a right, Le Right. The lovely roads we've got in here. They're not too bad. But never mind, when the car is good. Let's watch that come, Barry. You're not scared. Hmm. When wait. the I car is good, you're not scared. You're not scared. After this come, Barry, I would go. There we go. Now, Miss Ellie, just in case you've forgotten, there is the Olympic Lagoon. And you have missed a lot because it was very nice in there. So, off you go, Labouf. Let's go back the right way, down the Posadon, how do you say it? We're going up now. That way. That way. What's it called, this road? Posidonus Avenue. Posidonus Avenue, and most people go that way, because the hotels are behind us, and the harbour is that way. So if you're gonna go out and eat, or walk, and enjoy the sunshine, that's the way you're gonna go. So keep going, Labouf, nice and sensible, nice and slowly. Mr. Paul Poseidonos, yes. the god of I the can't water. Say it. I, I know what it is, the but I just can't say it. The god of the pools, yes. the god of the lakes, the yes. god of drinking water. The lakes of all lakes. Actually, he is a god of uh, washing machine water. Yes. That's strange, confused English, but never mind. Right, keep going. Could be. That hotel is called the Amva Amvari Way Inn. Amavi. Way in. Yes, that's what that one's called. And then this one, as we just showed you, is a Gumbaru of ours. And his name is Alexander, and apparently he's very great. And he's got a horse called Stavros. There it is. Thanks God it's not King Elephant. No, that's the one we can't pronounce. <laughs> Wonderful hotel. Right, let's continue. Let's continue, let's continue. Let's drive to the far end of the harbour okay. and go round the back. And then we'll park up round the back of the Jamalamo restaurant, the greatest. How do you say? Jamalamo. Jamalamo. If you want ice cream, waffles, pancakes to die for. They also do very good food, club sandwiches, that sort of stuff. Great cocktails, and they have.
have lovely glasses. And we ordered a box of glasses, but they've got to come all the way from Greece, so they're not going to be here for a while. Anyway, let's continue. That's the Annabelle Hotel there, isn't it? Annabelle yes. Hotel. And it's brother, Almira. Which is just over there. Yes. yes. So here's all the shops. Diamond shops. Hopefully it's closed. closed. No, the bugger's open. Mr. Paul's has got to deal with Keep them. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You've got to deal with Keep them. Going. All diamond shops are closed. Keep Mr. going, Lou. Ah, you don't want to talk about diamond no. shops? No. Keep going, Lou. Keep going, keep going. Come on, come on, come on. Come, come on, come on. So here we are, heading along the cobblestone promenade. And it's quite a dull evening tonight because, as I've said before, there's a lot of dust in the air, which is coming from the where? Sahura. Sahara to you and me. We're joking, like. We're joking. We're joking. We're joking. Really? Of course, really. Yeah. So we're going to show you the view in a minute because it is spectacular as it opens up. Look at that. Wow. If you want views to die for, come to Cyprus and we can die together. What a beautiful calm sea tonight, Babu. Yeah, Absolutely yeah. beautiful. It's the lakiest lake. What is it? It's the lakiest. It looks like a lake. It does and look then like I a say lake. It's the lakiest lake of the lakes. The lakiest lake of the lakes. Yeah. Perhaps we could get the Cyprus Tourism Authority to adopt that one. Yeah. Along with, if you want views to die for, come to Cyprus and we will. We will die together. Die together. Excellent. Look at the view across the harbour out to the fort. It truly is spectacular. If you're looking for somewhere to go on your holidays, well, we know we've got competition, but to be honest, Paphos is one of the greatest places in the world. So, get down to your local travel agents or get on the internet if you're more modern and Google it, Paphos, and book your holiday. Get down here. If you're stupid enough, you can come and hunt us down. We're always in this harbour area. You'll find us. I'm an idiot with a blue hat and she's beautiful and I've got a strange thing in my hand and I'm not a vicar. Anyway, there's a souvenir shop. It's always busy, this souvenir shop, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Always, always busy. Yeah. And there are the super yachts just about to come into view. And somewhere over there on the harbour, amongst the restaurants, are some Belgiques. And we're going to go and hunt them down. And we know what they look like because we've met them before. They are two of our superstar subscribers, Mr. and Mrs. Smoker. If you hunt the comments, you're going to find them. So if you want to get in a conversation with them, you can. If you want to ask them what we're actually like, you can. He'll probably say we're a couple of idiots, but never mind. He might be nice. Here's the car park to the rear. And there's the sun hiding behind the mist that's in the air. You know, yes, if this car had a tank, it, it would swear. About the road, you mean? Yeah. Yes. It would. Go a bit further. And then I think we'll save the car and park here, shall we? Yeah. Yeah. Are we allowed to park here? We're allowed to park anywhere. We are Marika and me. Oh. One of the most successful YouTube channels in the Cato Paphos area. The not. fame's gone very soon, very quick. The yes, fame. yes. Go, go, go. No, the fame's gone, I said not. Ah, good boy. Yes, oh, okay. exactly. But you never know. You Stick with us for a bit longer know. and you never know. You never know. This but if you're all. bored, yes, Marie? I'm taking the presents out. Yes, we've got two presents for our superstar subscribers. It's something that we like to do. So, in the back are two presents and some bananas. But ah, there yeah. is a present. And there is a present. So, that's for Mr. Smoker, and that one is for Mrs. Smoker. There you go, Lovely. Lovely. Yeah. Yes, thank you. Right. Are we going to lock it up? Because that's one of your things. Have you locked the car, Mr. Ford? You've got the keys, oh. Lovely. Oh. The big button on the top. The big one. Big button. That's it. And you see those things there? Yes, Mr. Paul. Yes. When they fold in, that normally means Just that this car is locked. When elephant goes guilty. Have you seen guilty elephant? 
No, but I know where the elephant hotel is. It's just over there. King of elephant, by the way. But when elephant is guilty, it goes. Does it? Shall we take the viewers down to the plage and give them that final view, and why then not, say good night? Yes. Why not? Because the view. Well, I think you'll understand what I'm going to say. It is to die for. It's one of the reasons why we come down to this area every single day. When it's raining, when it's sunny, January, February, June, July, makes no difference. The view is to die for. Let me take you with us. I quite like this. Uh, I know, uh, I mean, the bed, especially mm -hmm. for you, it makes them to feel very special. And I'm very happy that they both got what they wanted. Well, we know that Mr. Smoker is going to get what he wants. He's going to get one of these. And we've had it specially made for him. And hopefully he's going to wear it to his daughter's wedding. That's why it's a gift for him. He said, I happened to say to him, I've commissioned this. And he said, wow, I'd love to have one of them. And I actually said to him, why? You know, <laughs> what would you want to look like an idiot for? And he said, I think it'd be very nice because my daughter's going to get married next year he hopes they've been engaged for two and a half years and he's trying to encourage them to get married and he said he thinks that would be unique and special and he intends it to wear, to wear it to her wedding so i thought wow beautiful how lovely so he doesn't know but we commissioned it to be made luckily we got it made i know it's quite simple but normally it takes a few weeks for these things to happen so we paid a little bit extra and we got it made for him the following morning and we're going to give it to him now we hope he likes it i hope he treasures it and i hope his family and friends his daughter understands that it's something special and unique for her he's going to wear it but for her and i hope she has a great wedding and i hope her and her boyfriend live happily for the rest of their lives and i hope they only speak in flams not dutch or French. And I know their English will be very good and I know their German will be very good. So I'm only joking, I'm only joking. We're almost out the view. Stick with us because it is a view to die for. To be honest, tonight with the mist in the air, it seduced, seduced, it subdued the sun and it's going to make the view a little bit eerie but spectacular. That's it, Le Bouffe. What have you got to say? Well, talking, coming back, uh, coming, going back to smoker's uh, daughter i've sent her yesterday on the picture this is beautiful and i believe that she deserved the best marriage uh, in the world and she's beautiful yeah good. i've sent sarah good. and i hope that the dicky bow we give is a gift of love and i hope that her wedding to her boyfriend lasts a lifetime we'll leave you with a view and we'll say good night say good night Good night, goodbye everybody. Thanks for watching and thank you for staying with us and we will come back with any other place and with any other. Hello everybody, love you. Thanks for watching.